Hi folks, this is Andy and welcome to a Blender Quick Tip. I know it's been a while, but I'm having a kid in four days, so I've been a little busy. So today's quick tip, I'm going to show you how to kind of show off an object that you make. And I'm just going to make a little example object here. Let's say you just made a chair. Um, we'll take this default cube and turn it into a really simple chair. And uh, this part really isn't all that important. I probably actually should have made it before I started the tutorial. But I'm just basically extruding out a chair here. I'll extrude it back here. I'll move this up here. Rotate around it. And then subdivide the bottom a couple of times. And extrude four legs and then we've got a basic chair really simple chair uh, it's kind of a massive chair so I'll make it a little bit smaller that's a good size grab that on the z-axis put it down on the floor go to the camera view and let's render that out. As you can see, that's not very impressive looking. You want it, you don't want this gray background. You'd like to have like a floor to get a better idea of what the lighting looks like. So what I like to do is I like to add a stage. Um, stage is just a cube. And I just scale that cube up until the camera is in the cube and then I grab the cube and move it up on the z-axis so that the chair that I made is sitting on the stage inside this cube now that looks better you can see the the shadow and you can see the lighting and the chair is sitting in the middle but I want this to look more realistic. I want it to look more, I don't know, it just doesn't look all that nice. So there's a little trick that you can add here. If you go over to the World tab and check Ambient Occlusion, just checking that one simple thing is going to make the whole image look more realistic. You can see it adds grain and more subtle depth to the shadows and it makes the shadow less extreme and it sort of shows the object off a little more even though it's just the same basic object you can also turn the factor down if you don't want it to be so bright I'll turn the factor down to let's say 36 and now it's a little darker but it still has that more realistic look so that's ambient occlusion and staging just if you'd like to show off another one of your objects and have it look nicer i hope you got something from this tutorial and i'll be back soon with another tutorial and have a great